Welcome back to the first session after the inaugural of the International Conference on Disaster Resilient Infrastructure. This is a short session where we will announce uh, the winners of CDRI fellowships. Uh, CDRI fellowship program is a program to, en to encourage innovation uh, in order to address specific real world problem. Uh, the fellows can be in academia, they could be in practice, they could be community workers and they could be working on a whole range of problems uh, whether it is at the level of asset or it is at the level of more systemic planning, whether it is about nature based solutions or something as specific as safety of pedestrian bridges. So there is a, there's a wide scope uh, for uh, different kinds of um, applications to come in and propose uh, their innovation, innovative ideas to work on over a period of year. Uh, this was a global call uh, and uh, there was a long process. Uh, this is an opportune time to thank uh, colleagues who uh, worked with us in peer reviewing, in desk reviewing uh, the uh, applications and finally we had an international jury with uh, colleagues from the Asian Development Bank, a colleague from academia in Japan, US, United Kingdom and India evaluating these applications. Uh, this afternoon uh, in India, we have with us Dr. Charlie Benson. Uh, she is a principal disaster risk management specialist at the Asian Development Bank, uh, a leading economist working on uh, disaster economics for decades. Uh, my friend, uh, I would even say mentor, uh, has, uh, I have had the opportunity to work with over long years and she had kindly agreed to be on the jury. So I would like to invite her to uh, deliver her uh, remarks on the process that has uh, uh, happened uh, through which we have announced or selected these uh, fellows and then make announcements of who are the winners of the CDRI fellowships. Over to you Dr. Charlie Benson. Thank you very much, Kamal, for your kind words. Um, I'm extremely honoured to have been one of the five international jury members invited to judge the shortlisted fellowship applications. I would like to thank the Coalition for Disaster Resilient Infrastructure for that opportunity. I speak on behalf of all the judges in saying that we were most impressed by the really high standard of the submissions, outlining some extremely exciting and innovative ideas across a range of countries and themes. Between them, the full set of 143 submissions covered most, if not all, of the eligible thematic areas, namely on governance and policy, risk identification and estimation, standards and certification, capacity development and knowledge exchange, the use of emerging technology, recovery and reconstruction, financing, and community-based approaches. We saw submissions addressing a range of cu cutting edge solutions, for instance, around the application of artificial intelligence and space-based technologies, as well as submissions focusing on nature-based solutions and measures to strengthen community infrastructure, to mention just a few. It was particularly pleasing to see some excellent submissions involving younger people and to know that there's a strong wave of new disaster risk management practitioners and researchers stepping up to explore new solutions and the application of new technology to build disaster resilience and to help ensure that the errors of the past are not repeated in the future. That is so important. In an area which has historically been so heavily dominated by men as well, it was also fantastic to see so many applications from women. You're particularly encouraged in your work, be you one of the award winners tonight or not. Indeed, um, thank you so much to everyone who has submitted an application. It wasn't possible to award fellowships to each and every one of you, but please, please do continue to work in this critically important area. I very much hope that all the awardees will be back with us at future ICDRI events, hopefully face to face, to share your experience in taking your ideas forward and in particular to explain what impact your work has had on the ground in strengthening resilience 
and supporting the more rapid post-disaster recovery of critical infrastructure. We also look forward very much to your thoughts and ideas on how your work could be scaled up and replicated. So the very best of luck to all the awardees from all the judges, and we look forward very much to hearing about your progress. Thank you. Um, sh shall I invite you to uh, name the winners or shall I do that? I, I'm very pleased to name the winners. Um, I've you. got the information in front of me, so yes, no, it's my absolute pleasure to do so, to announce 21 successful fellowships um, that are being awarded today. So that's 21 fellowships in 2021, which seems highly fitting. The Fellowships then have been awarded as follows, presented please in no particular order, um, and also with my huge, huge apologies in advance, should I inadvertently mispronounce your name. So first, from India, Ms. Supriya Krishnan. Second, from India, Dr. Kailash Chanda Gupta. Third, from India, Dr. Pushp Bajaj, together with Mr. Saroob, Takor and Ms. Chimi Yudon. Fourth from Peru, Ms. Luisa Christina Wong Lent. Fifth from India, Dr. Swagata Banaji Basu. Sixth from India, Ms. Shreta Lal. Seventh from Nepal, Mr. Yagendra Subedi, together with Ms. Anushta Shrestha. Eighth from the United Kingdom, Dr. Richard. Freud, together with Dr. Richard Williams and Professor Trevor Hoey. Ninth from India, Ms. Akanksha Vadani, together with Ms. S. Singh, Ms. Meghna, and Ms. Ananya Goyal. Tenth from India, Mr. K. Natish, together with Mr. Abhijith. Eleventh uh, from Afghanistan, Mr. Mohammed Jawad. Nabizada, together with Mr. Ali Nixad and Ms. Hasina Naziri. Twelfth from India, Mr. Baraf Mahadevan, together with Mr. Aditya Subramanian. Thirteenth from Nepal, Mr. Kushal Raj Kliawali, together with Mr. Suman Chabaygan and Mr. K. Dahal. Fourteenth from Australia. Dr. Ahmed W.A. Hamad, together with Dr. Riza Yostia Sunin Dijo and Mr. Hafiz Suleiman Munawar. 15th from India, Dr. Santosh Subash Palmate. 16th from the United States of America, Mr. Andrew Estrain. 17th from Bhutan. Ms. Monica Tapa, together with Mr. Kirtan Adhikari, Ms. Sonam Chodan, Dr. K.S. Babu Narayan, and Dr. Sunil. 18th from India, Dr. Fasant Matsaga. 19th from Japan, Ms. Hanai Soma, together with Mr. Vipul Kumar Nakum. 20th from India, Dr. Indrajit Pal together with Professor Joya Sri Roy and Mr. Anil Kumar. And last but not least, the 21st awardee from India, Mr. Suja Rahman, together with Mr. S. Shridhar. So on that note, um, I'm pleased to say now that a video of the CDI Fellowship will be shown, including some further information on each of the awardees. Thank you.
Thank you very much uh, Dr. Charlie Benson for doing the honors. Thank you for your work on the jury and thank you for being with us uh, this afternoon in this program in making the announcements. Uh, it, I really look forward to meeting each one of these CDRI fellows, uh, hopefully at the next uh, event of uh, the, 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 the next edition of the International Conference on Disaster Resilient Infrastructure.